Now, I will to Bogobal to try and bring it to also known as the Ant Bear. It is a mammal native to Central and South America. It is one of foreign species of ant eaters. The oldest member of the genus Urmegophaga. And this is classified its law in the order of idols. This species is mostly the rest of the In contrast to the other living anteaters and small, it's an arboreal or semi arboreal. The giant anteater is the biggest of its family. 182 to 200. At 70 centimeters in length, with weights of 33 to 50 kilograms. Skin animal class mammalian. The giant ant is found in multiple habitats, including grasslands, rainforests. It forages in open areas and rests in more forest habitats. It feeds primarily on ants and termites, using its four claws to dig them out and its long, sticky tongue to collect them. So, giant ants live in overlapping home ranges. They are mostly solitary, except during mother of brief relationships. Aggressive interaction between males and when mating. <laughs> the giant anteater can be identified by its large size, elongated muscle, and long bushy tail. The head of the giant anteater, at 30 centimeters in length, is particularly elongated. Even when compared to other anteaters, it differs now with end in its tiny mouth opening and not closed. They have to move from its head. The eyes and ears are going to be small. Just more wrong. But its sense of smell is 40 times more sensitive than that of humans. Giant and beavers can live around 16 years in captivity. Even for an anteater, the neck is especially thick compared to the back of the head. And a small hump is found at the back of the neck. The coat is mostly grey, brown or black, and salted with white. The forelimbs are white with black bands around the wrists, while the hindwings 
I pardon your lack of faith is dirty. Don't fail me again, Admiral. There is no escape. Don't make me destroy you. The Emperor is not as good as I am. You don't know the power of the dark side. This is your captain speaking. First, I'd like to welcome everyone on flight A6A. We are currently cruising at an altitude of 33,000 feet and an airspeed of 400 miles per hour. The time is 1.25 pm. The weather looks good, and the tailwind on our side, we're expecting to land in London approximately 15 minutes ahead of schedule. The cabin crew will be coming around in about 20 minutes. Time to offer you a light snack and beverage. And the in-flight movie will begin shortly after that. I'll talk to you again before we reach our destination. Until then, sit back, relax, and enjoy the rest of the flight. Beautiful. 
veritable magnificent desolation. Thank <laughs> you. 